House Sitters is a 2002 Disney cartoon that aired as part of the House of Mouse episode, Pete's One Man Show. It kind of loosely fits into that episode because Pete is a character in this one. I don't really know how I feel about this though. I didn't love this cartoon. I didn't think it was the best I've ever seen, but I didn't hate it either. I think it's one that I enjoyed watching once, but probably wouldn't watch it again in a hurry. It starts off with us being taught about the Macats and the Corfields, these two families who feud. They both live on the top of opposite hills, but they share an outhouse. And one day they decide to just put their differences behind them and they find a way of working around this problem and they both go on holiday and they both hire house sitters. Um, Pete is house sitting one of the houses. Mickey, Donald and Goofy are house sitting the other. And they both realise that they start feuding with one another over a very similar problem. And, of course, watching it, we're wondering, will they overcome this problem or will they continue to feud? Their feuds seem to be worse and it seemed to escalate more, which is a given since it had to be kind of interesting and progressive rather than just being a, a re repetition of what we were taught at the beginning. Um, I will say it packed in a lot. It's a very busy episode. It's got a lot going for it. It's very well animated. It starts off the Macats and the Corfields we only see as kind of silhouettes. And that works very well. It was effectively done. Mickey, Donald, Goofy and Pete, of course, we see looking like themselves. I like their costumes. I like their mannerisms, the way they carry themselves. It's got a very kind of country and Western theme to it that I, I particularly enjoy. Um, Goofy was enamoured of the water, to be quite frank. Um, and I found him to be quite adorable in this one. Sometimes I don't like Goofy, sometimes I really do, and I rather enjoyed him here. The narrative developed at a very good pace. It, as I said, it's very quick, there's a lot going on, but not so much that it's difficult to keep up with. And I thought it was kind of surprising towards the end, it wasn't completely predictable. So there's nothing bad about it. There was nothing that I would pinpoint as saying I wish had been done differently, or I wish they'd maybe changed the focus. I think it's just there was nothing about it that I loved. There was nothing about it that stood out to me as being particularly amazing or unique or creative or whatever. And there are going to be cartoons like that. Not every Disney cartoon can be phenomenal. Some of them are just pretty decent. And I think House Sitters falls into that category. Maybe I'll watch it again in the future in isolation rather than part of House of Mouse. But for now, I'm pleased I've seen it once. I do recommend it at least once. Maybe I'll watch it again eventually.